I got to do it. I got to challenge you to a hole. And we're going to play on the old course at St. Andrews. Yeah, we've, uh, we've pulled up hole number one okay. uh, at the St. Andrews. And a fairly easy course. You know, there's no pot bunkers on this for you to worry about. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. so, so what are we looking at at this hole? Basically, you're looking at 358 yard hole. Okay. okay. First hole, the seven feet downhill is from where you're standing on the tee block to exactly where the green is, way out in the distance. On the right hand side here, we have a, uh, almost an overview map of okay. what you can uh, look for. Right. So it's got me on the, the tee first. Uh, so I will hit my drive. Good luck on this one. Good luck. And uh, we'll see who fares well. Sounds good. We'll play good. this one right out. Okay, so cool. drive is in the middle of the fairway. So, Jason is in the middle of the fairway. I'm swinging cold, just want to point that out. And that hit the track, yeah, that's good. Is now I want to how, say, uh, I did this on purpose because I've heard the angle going in from the left is a little bit better on this hole. Seven iron for my second shot here. I'm 187 yards out and I've got a great view from the left side of the fairway. Let's see how we do. Ooh, Get on the green. That was nice. Come on now. Now I did say from the left side is a better view, so Let's see what Jason can do now. Yeah, Ken's put it pretty close. So. A little bit to the right. Whoa. A little too much spin. So here we are on the green. Now, the one thing with St. Andrews is they have some of the biggest greens on the tour. Right. Some of them are shared, so there's some really long putts. So I've got 60 feet up 9 inches. i got to putt this 69 feet, and it's running a little right to left at first. It could move left to right, and then another left to right at the hole. So we're going to just try and get this thing as close as we can within 8 feet. All right, let's give this a shot. There's your right to left, and then it should come back into the hole oh. and a little too far. It is, it is interesting to try and, and, and judge it, but I feel once you have a few putts through, you're going to pick it so up So this easy. one, you want to only go three feet past the screen. Okay. That's going to be about six feet past the screen. So you should be about four feet too far. Got it. Here, 13 feet down, six inches. Very flat putt. So I don't even want to get to the screen. It didn't move though. Wow. No, I pulled it a little bit to the left and it just stayed it where just it was. stayed where it was. Jason, and I thought I was going to really whip him and we ended up bogeying. Honestly, it was an awesome experience. Well, and thanks for coming out. Thank you for having us. No and problem. if you're looking at something to do uh, as a pastime, if you're an avid golfer or, you know, you really want to work on your game, Come and talk to Jason here at the Golfers Academy in Burlington, and it's an awesome experience.